on YouTube, United Gamer here, and welcome everyone to another episode of the Pokemon Diamond Extreme Randomizer Nuzlocke. How are you beautiful people doing? Hope you're having a fantastic day. In the last episode, everyone, we ended up taking on the fifth gym, which I was not expecting to do it, but I went ahead, you know, I was feeling confident, we went ahead and did it, we had time in the video, but we ended up losing a member of our team. I don't know what it is about me, guys. I have no idea, no explanation, but I cannot keep Electivires alive to save my life. I am 0 for 4 with trying to use them in my series. They always end up dying no matter what. So I absolutely refuse to ever try to use another one of them in any of my series. If you guys are still enjoying this series though, be sure to show that United Family love by smacking that like button. You know, we're trying to hit around 300 likes per episode, but when it comes down to it guys, I much rather, you know, have your guys feedback, your comments. I love reading what you guys think of the video, answering the comment question. I much rather you go ahead and do that comic question of the day though guys if you could have any pokemon game ever remade what would it be and now i know a lot of people will probably say this game right here diamond and pearl and platinum we know we had a lot of rumors and leaks of sino remakes that we ended up not getting uh we got a ultra sun and ultra moon instead which, yes, I'm excited for. It's a new Pokemon game. But I gotta admit, I would have been a little bit more excited. Actually, a lot more excited if it was Diamond and Pearl remakes. I absolutely love Sinnoh. But let me know in the comment section below to have your chance to be nicknamed a Pokemon on this journey. Let's go ahead and load today's spinner and see what we can get. Can I get a lucky day? I am still have not ever got one of those. That would be so nice. An item toss. Okay, then. That could be really bad or actually really good. It depends if I have any uh, berries. If I don't have berries, I'm going to be screwed. Item toss, simply enough, means I have to toss all of one item's category. So, you know, just regular items, medicine, Pokeballs, TMs, and we do. We have one berry. That is so clutch. All right. This is not a bad challenge at all. Basically, nothing happened. I'm liking this already. Let me go over the team really quick, though. Uh, because we do have a new member out here. We have Dishwasher out here, a Bug and Fire Explode. Now, I know some people are probably like, why do you have this guy out here? Why are you not using Cacturn, you know, that you train so much to get? He's like level 33. Well, the reason for that is, you know, Cac Cacturn and Explats have similar, like, stat totals. I think it's only like a five difference. You know, and Cacturn can deal off a lot more damage than Dishwasher here. But Dishwasher can take the hit, and that's what I really need from it, because in an Extreme Randomizer, you never know what's going to happen. It's like, you know, in the last episode, Skunk Tank, Dragon Claw, Critical Hit, One Shot, Electivire, which has pretty good defense. So I definitely need to go with Explode so he can last longer than Cacturn. I hope that makes sense. Uh, but you know what? I see the XP shirt on there. But I actually want to train up Taco. I think Taco finally needs to get some love. He's our only water type on the team. And I think he's going to come through. And he already knows, like, Hydro Cannon and does not even know Surf. So I need to teach it to him really quick. So we're going to go ahead and do that. Also, a little note here. If you notice something a little bit different about the background, I mentioned it in my Uranium series, uh, that I got a brand new chair, all thanks to my wife that surprised me with it today as I walked outside and saw a giant box out there. If you follow me on Twitter, you already know. Or watch Uranium. Um, I'm gonna get rid of Whirlpool just in case we need Hydro Cannon in the future But yeah, so I got a brand new chair because my other one was falling apart. So thank you much uh, So thank you so much Alexis and yes, I am married for those who don't know every time I mention I have a wife I see it in the comments to so several people are like wait you're married. Yes, I've, I've mentioned her several times We got married about you know almost five months ago. Let's see what we got though. Oh Flareon, I will gladly take that level 27 not a bad level. I want to catch this thing. All right the question is, what type are you? I don't know how much damage I can do to you right now. I do not want to risk it. Level 27, Flare has way too powerful moves. I'll go, I'll go to X-Road. I'll go to X-Road, and we'll use a Toxic, and I'll think the best way. It might be a Electric type, which is okay if he has, like, I was about to say, it's okay if he has, like, Thunder Punch, Bolt Tackle, anything like that. That will deal some crazy damage. Oh, wait, that's going to do some damage. He has great attack. Okay, let's just go between him and Hisoka. So it won't really do any damage to us no matter what we do. And he can't even affect Storm. I definitely want this. All right, let me just try it right here. And we have two Ultra Balls. Let's go for it. Come on, Flareon. Join the United Family. Can we get this thing? Not even a single shake. All right, that's not a good sign. All right, well, I have like two more tries. I have one more try. Literally my last try right here. My only way I could have hurt this thing, though. There's no other way. Hey, it's in the red, too. Come on. One. 
no! Why won't you save the Pokeball? There we go. We lost Fla Flareon. That's he's gonna kill himself. I don't see how else I really could have hurt him. I guess I could have ended up using Hisoka. There we go. I'm sorry, guys. I was sure that a Ultra Ball would have caught that thing if it was in the red. I don't know why we have such bad luck with trying to catch the thing. Now I could have used like Energy Ball and stuff, but I didn't know that you know beforehand. It's all right. Maybe we'll get a reroll. We know we can come back right here and get a Flareon, so that's really nice. And let's go ahead and head on through here. That's so unfortunate, too. Like, having Thunderpunch on Flareon is really beastly. Dylan, long time no see. Oh, you look puzzled. You're wondering who I am. I'm Professor Rowan's assistant and Don's father. I thought we already met him. The professor asked that I upgrade your research, you see. Because, yeah, I did, because he's British. So I chosen this spot in a hunch that you'd pass through. Dylan, may I have a look at your Pokedex for a second? Let's see. Was I supposed to put the software here? A chunk. All done. I've upgraded your Pokédex. I, I should explain how it's been upgraded, shouldn't I? It can explain the images of male and female Pokémon. Okay, I'll leave you to carry on with your project for the Professor. May I also ask you to keep an eye out for Team Galactic? The Professor is concerned about what happened in Jubilee City. It's probably nothing to worry over. I'll be on my way. Oh, on my way now. All right. Sorry about that. I'm just gonna have to. He's gonna have to just phase out and lose his accent, so I don't lose viewers. <laughs> Anyways, uh, where are we hurt or anything? Yeah, we actually are kind of hurt. Let's go ahead and stop by Nurse Joy. How you doing, beautiful? Can I heal my Pokemon up? Thank you ever so much. We have like a rival battle right up ahead, I think. I think it's right here, actually. It is right here. What do you want, Brooks? Whoops. Hey, Dylan. You're going to challenge a gym leader up past head? Oh, I need to explain something really quick. This isn't the comic question, and I'm glad I thought of it now. All right, so, you know, two episodes ago... Uh, for one, I forgot to cut out in the beginning, and I talked about how I had to crap so bad. A little funny. I was in college, and I see people like, why did you say you have to crap yourself? I messed up in editing and forgot to cut. That was so funny, though. I'm glad you guys... I'm glad you guys got to experience a little behind the scenes of like when I mess up and stuff because crap like that happens. It's so funny. Crap it, like that happens. You actually kind of scared me, Brooks. I jumped. Brooks is over there. Anyways, I wanted to mention something. When I ask you guys, do you want a versus or a soul link? So many people ask me what is a soul link. Even people ask me what's a versus. So I'm going to explain that as we battle Brooks right here, starting off with a soul link. Now, a Soul Link, the first person I ever saw do it, I don't think they were the first person to do it ever, though, is obviously King Nappy and uh, Shady Penguin. It's a very, very popular YouTubers. I'm shocked if you've heard of me and not them. Like, I'm truly shocked. Anyways, what you do is the Pokemon that you catch on the same route are forever linked together, and if one dies, the other one faints along with it. If a person does not catch a Pokemon, the other one cannot catch a Pokemon on that route. And you try together to go through the game and beat the game together, and it makes it really hard and challenging. I've never done one before and I think it would be so funny and so insane to see me and Brooks do that. And then a versus, if you don't know what a versus is, I'm really shocked. Like, that's very common. Not just in, even in Pokemon, but uh, okay, of course we're not very effective. What type are you? Vice Grip? Uh, let's go with the Nice Beam. How much is that going to do? Still not. Oh, but, wait, if you're Grass, how am I not very effective then? Wait, no, it's Fire, isn't he? Tyranitar's Fire, so yeah. I need to get out of here. Alright, um... Fire, fire, what can I do with fire? Storm, you still haven't learned to move, so I can't go to you. I'll just go to Extrode and use uh, Poison Jab. That should do a good bet. There we go. But a versus just means you both play the game alongside each other, and whoever can beat the game first wins. So it's kind of more competitive. The other one's just more, like, casual, and you just have insane moments with trying to, like, keep yourself alive. It's going to be an extreme randomizer, so we have no idea what's ahead of both of us. And I think it would be fun, you know. We'll probably do both in the future anyway, but I wanted to explain that. So now you can kind of vote again if you don't know or if you didn't know what it was. We'll just keep extra out here. Murkrow, simply enough. All right, so you're not grass, apparently, because I would be super effective. I don't know why everything seems to know grass-type moves and not be a grass-type. That's not even making any sense right now. A Reggie Gigas! I have fought this thing so many times in this series. I can't remember to save my life what type it was. I feel like it's dark, and if that's the case, I'm really messing up right now. I'm really messing up if he's dark. I feel like he is dark. I don't know if I should do this. I really don't know if I should do this. Luster Perch. It's level 32, too. Rock Wrecker. Maybe it is rock. That's going to do a lot of damage, though. I don't care if it's not very effective. That's 150 base stat. All right, so if he's rock type, that's oh no, not bad for us, but that does a lot of damage, and he's going to just eat this up completely. Yeah, not very effective, too. Can I get a lowered special defense? Can I get a lowered special defense? No, I cannot. All right. 
rock record. Do you have to rest on the next turn? I'm almost certain you do. So if you're rock type, I could go to Hisoka. We need to heal up Hisoka and then use like an energy ball or something. I don't know what two types you're going to be though. I guarantee you're dual type. You do have to recharge. So I'm going to take this opportunity just to go ahead and heal up just to make sure we're fully good. Hisoka, I revived you with a holy sacrifice last episode. I need you to come through right now. It's gonna use rock, it use Doom Desire, so it's that and Steel, that's not good. Oh man, I don't know what to do with this thing. If I had a fighting type move, that would be so nice right now. Let's try a Leaf Storm. I just wanna see how much this does. You do not want this thing to use a rollout. Something's gonna die, something's gonna die. This thing using rollout, doubling its attack each turn. I gotta get this thing dead. Something's gonna die. I, there's nothing I can do, he's gonna eat that up too. And I lower my special attack. There's nothing I can do! I'm literally gonna die right here. Something is gonna die. I could go to Storm, which he's gonna use Rod again. It's gonna do a good bit of damage. I expect... Oh, God, no. Storm coming in clutch, baby! I cannot believe he lived! He took a Doom Desire, already weak from a Reggie Gigas. I was certain we would have died right there. I was so sure we would have died. Such a beast. I forgot about Doom's Desire. All right, Raw, you're going to eat that up. See how much damage that does? That's not very effective, too, but it's still going to keep coming at me. So I got to heal again. It missed! Let's go! That's so perfect! All right, um, Luster Purge again. I just got to get a lower special defense. It needs a lower special defense. All right, we know we can eat one of those up. And it could... It, okay, now this should do good. Lower its special defense, please. Because then I could come back out with Ahsoka, use Leaf Storm, and that would one-shot it. And we did not get a... Oh, no. He does have to rest a turn. Oh, no. Oh, what should I do here? You know, okay. Extra can't... Uh, you know, Extra can't hurt it. Flare can't hurt it. Storm has nothing for it. Blast Burn still wouldn't even do anything because it's rock and steel. I need a fighting type. All right, a fighting type move, but I don't. It has a recharge. Even a Leaf Storm won't kill this thing. A Leaf Storm will not kill this thing. All right, so he has a recharge, but the question is if he uses Rock Wrecker again, I'm doomed. That's what's making me nervous. Should I heal right here or should I just go in and think he's going to use Rollout again? I'm going to go in and just hope he doesn't use. He used Stealth Rock. That's actually not bad. That's not bad. I'm glad you wasted your turn with that. I shouldn't have used Leaf Storm then if you were going to do that, because that's going to lower my special attack. I could have stayed out here. Uh, this would be nice if I could get a crit. Let's go! Isoka didn't even need the critical hit. Knocked out the Reggie Gigas. Man, so it's Rock and Steel type. I need to write that down so I don't lose anything to that. Having Rock record, though, that would do some crazy damage on something, even no if it was normally effective. Good job, Taco. You would have came in clutch right there if I would have had you. A Cradily. All right, that thing is dark, right? Or is it fire? Jesus, my memory is being really bad right now. If it's fire, I don't need to send you out. I'm going to go to X-Road, and we're going to heal him up. Just, I don't really remember. Flatter. That does not help me at all. And it's, I'm just going to use a Toxic on it, just so we can maybe get that off. Let's go, X-Road. Nice job. All right, so that'll start eating it away, just in case I need to stall. The, that's what sucks about Reggie Gigas, though. If I need a stallmate like that, I can't do that with him. All right, so it's it is dark type. That's okay. That does a good bit of damage, though. We do have speed boost right here, but dang, man, I need to go ahead and just use my hyper potions right here. That's gonna do damage. That's gonna do crazy amounts of damage. I don't want to risk that. It has Dragon Rage too. Shoot, Extra can't do anything out here. I need something else out here. Storm can't take any hits. Maybe Flare and then come out here and use a Spatial Rend? It goes with a Dragon Rage. Which, you know, normally is, that's okay as long as it keeps doing that. It does use Payback. How much is that going to do to Flare? Good job, Flare. Alright, I don't know if Flare can outspeed the thing. I don't think so. I'm, gonna let the, I'm just going to let the Toxic eat it away. Toxic comes in clutch with stuff like that. It does. Alright, Taco is learning Aqua Tail. Nice job. So now he'll know some really good moves. Oh man, I wish I didn't have him no fly. I'll get rid of with I'll get rid of withdrawal. Um, we'll be all right with that. That Aquatel can become you know come in handy just in case something is better with special defense. And just see, is that your last Pokemon or do you have another one? You have one more, a Pillow Swine. Thank God it's not a Mammoth Swine. All right, so last Pokemon. Um, I am gonna just play my chances right here and go with Extrode. Go with Extrode. We are just gonna go ahead and heal up. 
I am already almost out of potions, though, because this guy destroyed me. Is it water type? All right, so yeah, we're gonna knock this thing out really quick. There we go, Dancer Brooks is dead. Wow, that was a very intense battle. Like, that was crazy. Yeah, yeah, you're just a bit better than me, as usual. But listen up, let me tell you who's gonna take on the Pokemon League and become the champion. You guessed right, it's gonna be you. Anyways, you should be able, you should be able to take on the gym leader here. Hurry up and go make the challenge. Well, I need to heal up and buy some potions, though. Because I am flat out broke. Thank God we did not have, like, a market crash today. Uh, a gambling addiction. I still have not rolled a gambling addiction. I'm going to cry whenever that happens. That's going to be so bad to happen. All right. Where is the market? The market's... Um, they have a market in here. There it is. Okay. I knew they did. All right. Let's buy one. Let's see. We don't have a lot of money. I'm just gonna load up on potions right now. I don't have a lot of Ultra Balls either, but Hyper Potions, that should be good enough for us to go take on the gym. I'm a little bit nervous with this gym. I am. You know, we haven't done any off-cam training, and we're doing back-to-back-to-back-to-back -to -back -to -back -to -back gyms. This is four gyms in a row, guys. And I'm, I am a little bit nervous. You know, we're still trying to train Taco right now because I need a water type on the team. Let's go ahead and see if we can do okay with this gym. Level 33, Energy Ball. All right, we should be able to do... Okay, you'll eat that up, you'll eat that up, you'll eat that up, you'll eat that up, you'll eat that up. There we go. Whew. All right, Ahsoka. Doing all right, buddy. Just gotta stay alive for me like that. <laughs> Please, dear God, do not die. I, I do not want to lose you. I want to battle as many trainers as I can in here, though, guys. I need to get a lot of training done, to be honest. And we have a speed-up button, at least. So, all right, you're super defensive, but luckily we're super effective. Free one-shot, which your special defense isn't as good. Uh, come on up here. And... Alright, that was literally useless. Come in this one. I do not know this puzzle by heart, just so you guys know. Alright, we'll battle, like I said, as many trainers as we can right now. I'm really excited to try to, try to do a soul link, though. I think that'll be a ton of fun when we bring that to the channel. You know, because that'll be new for me, new for Brooks. It'll be a new thing for the channel. I have a little bit more variety, because I know, you know... You guys might be thinking my videos get stale sometimes, even though when my last comment question was how do I improve my videos, so many people were like, you know, just keep doing you, you're doing great, and that means, you guys have no idea how much that means to me. So many times, guys, I, I don't think, I, I, I just think, you know, there's a lot better YouTubers out there than me, you know, like, Brooks is even a better YouTuber than me and doesn't get the credit he deserves. Like, I'm being serious, though. Like, he, he he's really great with, you know, he's very funny, so you definitely check out Brooks. But anyways, there's a lot of Poketubers out there, and it means so much to me that you guys watch these videos every single day. Like, that means so much. You have no idea. All right, he's destroying me right now. Hypno's taking my butt. All right, I said slow poke or slow bro. So we'll go to Storm. Oh, slow king. All right, Luster Purge. All right, normal fight. Rock throw. We'll eat that. Oh, man, there we go. This is going to be nice for us. Not gonna be able to do anything for us. He's learning a move! What move was it? I didn't see! He's learning a move! Please be ground. It is ground! I mean, it's bone rush. Not the best thing in the world, but it's ground! It's finally a move! Let's get rid of Roar of Time. We don't need two dragon type moves. We finally got a ground type move. It's not the best. I would have taken many others over this, but I'm not gonna complain. He learned a move. He learned a freaking move. It is about time, Storm! Oh my god, and the worst thing is though, you have such bad accuracy with Bone Rush. You have horrible accuracy. 80. I hate that. 80 always feels like 30 to me. There's no way that's 80. Alright, we'll heal up. I don't feel like running all the way back to the PC. Um, well, since everything's kind of healed up though, we'll, we'll go back to the PC uh, before we go to the actual fight. And Espeon, bulky Pokemon, crazy special attack. Uh, who has the best special defense on our team? 64, 64... So, Hisoka, probably, I imagine. No, we'll go to Extra because it has speed boost. So, no, no, no. Well, I want to shift you. There we go. Hyper Fang. Okay. All right, Poison Jab. It doesn't have the best special... It hasn't had the best defense, though. But we're not very effective. So, we will outspeed it. Hyper Fang is not going to do anything to us. And it's going to try to put me to sleep. But that's okay. I'm not even worried about that. All right, you can put me to sleep. I'm just going to keep you out here. Lombre Dragon Dance. No, 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 no. Oh, God. We'll eat that up, but Jesus. All right, so he's going to keep using Dragon Dance, apparently. But the good thing is he's using Dragon Pulse. It's special. Oh, my God. <laughs> this Lombre is a beast. All right, can we get on? Can we wake up, please? I don't want to waste all of my potions. Oh, no, 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 no. Okay, apparently he's dragging aground. He's dragging aground. All right, we'll go to Storm and just use Draco Meteor. Well, I just wasted those potions. I'm sorry. But I wasn't expecting him to be dragging and ground. I don't know why he wouldn't start off with that. 
Anyways, let's keep going. This is actually, I ran into an Arceus when I did a Platinum series here, so let's hope that doesn't happen right now. I want to make sure we at least get to the end before anything else. I do not have any full hills either. All right. And I tossed my only berry that hills awakening, so we're not using X-Strode. Uh, we'll fully heal storm. I can buy more potions. I can sell some stuff if really necessary. A Tangela, though. All right. We'll go to his Soko. Wing attack. No, we won't. Man, extreme randomizers are freaking hard. <laughs> I was not expecting to do that much. Okay, we'll go to Flare. Oh my god, there's nothing I can do here to a Tangela. I'm gonna, I'm gonna loop. I can't run. I'm not trying to run. All right, I gotta go to Dishwasher. Even though Dishwasher is such a low level, I got to. Oh, that's so frustrating. Okay, what do I gotta do here? What do I gotta do here? I think Hisoka can take a hit, and I think it's Ice and, like, Bug. So I gotta go with an Ice Beam. It's a one-shot. The reason I was going to him is he was using bug type moves and I'm bugging fire with Exploud and he would have ate that hit. So I guess we are going to use Mercs, but that's okay. You know, Cacturn is a good Pokemon. Sorry about that. God, that's so frustrating. If he would have just used, kept using bug type moves, we would have been, okay. been okay. And I think that's pretty much it. Yeah, that is it. So now we are at the gym uh, leader, but we are not going to take him on quite yet. I do need to go heal up, buy some potions, and put in Mercs for our squad. We're going to go ahead and take a break and have today's United Bonus Round. Welcome to the United Bonus Round. In the previous episode, we heard the following Pokemon's cry. <coughs> this was none other than the Pokemon Finnegan. Now, answer the following Pokemon's cry correctly to send United Gamer a challenge or a bonus in an upcoming episode. Ten of you must get this correct to complete this bonus round. <coughs> Let's get back into the video. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, it is time to take on the sixth gym. May God rest our souls and have no more deaths anymore. Ah, it's the Arbor's Gym Badge. I see, I see. You've defeated my son, but that's no surprise. He still has much to learn. In place of my son, Rourke, I, Byron, will take your challenge. All right, everybody. I am so nervous right now. This gym could destroy us, but I'm believing we can maybe turn this around and Joey and, you know, take the winner here. Starting off with an Aerodactyl. All right. Nothing too extraordinary. Level 36. So after this, I think it's safe to say I need to do some off-cam training. Does he have download? He does have download, but he's a physical attacker, so that's okay. I am going to start with a Luster Purge. A Steel Wing. Okay, so if you're Steel type, I could use a Blast Burn, although that would not do too well for me because I got a rest and... No, okay, that's not going to do that much, though. That's not going to do that much to him. We did get the lower special defense. That is convenient. All right, so... I do think a Blast Burn would kill this thing. I do. Um, but the thing is, I gotta rest the next turn. So it's really risky. It's gonna use Iron Defense. I am gonna go for it now, because I think we can withstand two Steel Wings. It's gonna do it again. It's messing up. Doesn't even matter. I'm not using a Physical Attack. And I already lowered a Special Defense. I would be shocked if this thing does not one-shot this. Literally shocked. Super effective like I expected. All right, it did one-shot it. Okay, nice. Good job, Storm, starting, it off, starting us off strong. All right, let's keep, let's keep this going. We gotta make sure we keep this in, you know, in pure focus mode. No more deaths. No more. A Glalie. We, ha we have a Glalie. We have a Glalie. It's a grass. I feel like it's grass. It's bug. It's bug. I'm almost certain it's bug. So I am gonna go to Extrode. I really need to fire. I, I, I could go to, I could have went to Murex. I don't wanna, I don't know why I didn't go to Murex. But Extrode will be all right too. He's not gonna be able to do anything to me. I'm almost certain that he's bug. Cause I know we have one of them. Level 39! Oh my god! And he has download, though. I'm gonna go with the poison jab right here. He's gonna outspeed me. He has a leech life. It's not gonna do anything to me. Not worried about that. The thing about Murex, though, is I'm fire and psychic, though. So you gotta remember that. So at least x can withstand the hits easily. And we have speed boost. So I think this was the better way to go. Dude, get a bit of damage right here. I was hoping we get the poison off. We did not. That is kind of unfortunate. But honestly, he cannot do anything to me. We're now outspeeding it. I think we're in the clear. Can we get a poison off, though? That, oh, has Thunder Punch, though. That did a good bit of damage, honestly. That one that one worries me a little bit more. All right, all right. Uh, Thunder Punch again. All right, maybe I don't want to use you. Okay, shoot. 
man, that's not good. I can't go to Ahsoka. I can't go to Storm. I guess I could go to Mercs. It's just, Mercs can't take hits. I already explained that before. I need him to use something other than Thunder Punch. I need him to use something else. Twin Needle, thank you for messing up. All right, that's perfect. And he didn't do that much. Okay, sick. I'm gonna go, I'm gonna go with a Toxic just so we can stall because this thing is tearing me up. It missed! Leech off again. Okay, so we can withstand a Thunder Punch. We can withstand a thunder, thunder Punch. We know that. I need this Toxic to land. You got- Oh, I thought it missed again. I literally thought it missed again. All right. That's good. That's so clutch for us right now. All right, Glalie. You're going with a Mega Horn. All right. We should be able to eat that up, though. Oh, good job, Extro. That's so good. Whew. All right. So now we can definitely- We can just- We can stall. I have to waste potions, but we can stall. That's all right. He's going to go with the Twinidal again. All right. So what I'm going to do is just go for a Poison Jab. Eat that. There we go. Uh, the, po the Toxic should kill right here. Lately, honestly, a little bit more painful than I expected. I could have used a Blast Burn by uh, Frogator, but I would have had to switch in and out. Otherwise, you know, because I had to rest from using it against Aerodactyl. So I think I made the right decision. Extra, can you get a level? You can. Level 32. Nice. All right. Two down. Is that two or three down? That's two down. An area does. Okay. We should be all right with this thing. Um, let's go to Hisoka. I'm gonna hope and guess that we're super effective, or at least just resistant. That would be really nice. If you're somehow like a water type, I would love that. What level are you? Level 36. Okay, that's what I thought. 39 was his highest level. I didn't think he'd get into the 40s. All right, let's see if we can do this. Start off with, let's just start off with an energy ball. The scary thing about using Hisoka is no matter what they use, it's gonna land on us because of his ability. We're normal affected, that's okay. All right, now what are you though? Crush Grip. All right, can you eat that up for us, please? All right, good job. But that makes me nervous. That makes me so nervous. Oh man, because that did almost half my health. If he gets a crit, I'll lose Ahsoka. Oh God, Teeter Dance. Why would you do that? That's fine with me. Now I'm gonna go ahead and heal Extrode because if I need to go to him, that's perfect. Which I think I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna go to extra because he can take hits better. He'll, he'll eat that a lot better. All right, so that did about, let's see, about 50 damage. So we can withstand another hit of those. We're gonna go with a poison jab. Normal effective, should do a good bit of damage. It did not kill it, that's unfortunate. Energy ball. All right, well, that's okay. I don't know what type you are then. That's not gonna do anything to me. I don't know why you would put in a, use your other one, your crush grip. That's fine though. That, as long, he'll heal though, he's gonna heal. Yeah. I thought so. Full restore right here. We got the poison jab off. Shoot, that's so unfortunate. <laughs> All right. It is counter though. All right, good thing we healed. This is a very like intense match. Like I'm really having to think here. All right, so now he's not gonna heal. We got the poison off again. No, <laughs> that's actually not good because now he's gonna get hurt down into the red zone. He's gonna heal his Pokemon up again with a full restore and the poison will be gone. And I took a hit. Unless he doesn't heal somehow, but I think he will. Yep. No, we did it! All right, there we go! That's the, that's the sixth gym! We did it! No deaths, besides losing Exploud. But I didn't think he was gonna use a wing attack. All right. We didn't lose any main members, though, and Taco got a good bit of training done today. Whoa, baby! I need to do some training. Uh, like, the levels are getting in the 40s now, and I don't have anything close to that. So I really need to start doing the train. You are strong enough to take down my prize team of Pokemon. In recognition of the power, I give you this! The Mind Badge! Thank you, Byron. Oh, man. I'm feeling good. The Mind Badge enables you to use the hidden move strength anytime outside of battle. And you now have six gym badges. That means all Pokemon up to level 70 will obey you without question. Here's a yes. Earthquake, 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 earthquake. Please, God, that would be so nice for Storm. Vice Grip. All right. If it hits, then may lower the target's defense. It's not what I want. Uh, what are my TMs? You know, I haven't really looked at them. Like, there's Vice Grip. I don't think it's like too fantastic. I wish we could have got something a little better, but it could have been worse. We could have gave a splash. <laughs> I always got to think that, you know, it could have been worse. We have good uh, TMs. Like I said, I could teach him Frenzy Plant. Uh, who can learn Thunderbolt? Can anyone learn fun Thunderbolt? Mercs can. He has good special attack. He just doesn't have stab, but I don't want to waste that on him just in case we end up using an electric type move. That, that wouldn't even have been good on Flareon though, because it's not a physical attack. I still wish we would have got that Flareon though. We didn't even have a catch today. That's so unfortunate. That's like, I could go to the place where you catch Lucario before the episode ends. 
Hey, that's the mind badge. Good going. You're tough enough to consider becoming the champ. Of course, I'm tougher. How? You've never beat me. So it's not going to actually happen. Anyway, Zillin, come with me to the library. I really don't want to do that. Can I go to that place where you normally get Lucario, the egg? Or Riyalu, to be, you know, exact? Because you got to go through this whole cutscene right here. We could say that for the next episode, though. I always feel kind of sad, though, when we don't even get one encounter. Hey, they went over here this way. I'm still waiting for the day that I get my extra life and get to bring back Loxus. I know I want my boy Loxus back. Okay, Gramps, I brought it in like you said. All right, I'll be out of here. Okay, I get it. Hmm, everyone is here finally. Dylan, everyone listen. You may have forgotten lately, but I study the evolution of Pokemon. But the more that I study, the more mysteries appear and multiply. Pokemon that evolve and those that don't. What makes them different from each other? But th but those that are immature are living beings evolved to one another's ma ma major. If so, what do we make of these legendary Pokemon that don't evolve? Are we to assume that legendary Pokemon are complete as creatures? Then this is where you three come in. In the three lakes of Sinnoh, there are said to be three. They are fed. They are fed to be three Mirage Pokemon. If we begin to obtain data on them, I may shed some light on how the process of Pokemon evolution works. I need help from each one of you of that grand undertaking. Help me find these three Pokemon that are considered to be Mirages. What are you saying? I don't get the Pokédex. Ah, who is it that has bolted from the lab before I had the chance to give you a Pokédex? He's been going through all six badges and doesn't even have a Pokédex! But that's what under the bridge. Seeing Pokémon with our own eyes, it's important for you to becoming a better trainer too. You can count on me, or you'll be a help- I will be help with my Pokédex. It will help with my Pokédex too. Dylan, won't you go too, won't you? Hmm. I would have made all of you regardless anyway. <laughs> now there are three lakes. Fortunately, there are three of you. You should therefore sprint up and investigate the lakes individually. Don, you got a Lake Verity. We'll do. Brooks, I want you to go to investigate Lake Acuity. Ac Ac Acuity. <laughs> we'll just keep that. That would take almost the Sober City. The road there is harsh. I need a tough trainer to go. Why? Why him then? Oh yes, of course, Gramps. You know how to call it. You can count on this. <laughs> you can tell I'm the hotness. <laughs> and that leaves you, Dylan, with Lake Valor, the lake between Valston and Pastoria, if memory serves. I love how we just nonchalantly just sit there in our chairs while an earthquake happens. Has it stopped? Are all of you unharmed? <laughs> Not even a book fell off the shelf. Let's go outside and be careful. I'm concerned about the city. Concerned about the city. Literally not even like a book fell off the shelf. Dylan, hurry along. But beware of aftershocks. Isn't there like a TV in here or something when in platinum? Isn't that part a little different? If, our, if my memory serves me correctly, as Rowan says. I love how I just randomly gave him a lisp in the middle of that. <laughs> Hmm, that tremor wasn't a natural occurrence. Hey, hey, old dude and kid, something big just happened. They're saying that it was a huge explosion in Lake Valor. Kaboom, like that. That's all he had to say. Gramps, I'm going to the lake. I have a bad feeling about this. But that's, that's Dawn's life. That, Brooks, can't sit still. Feel what I'm worried about Lake Valor. But I have no idea what's taking place. You must find out. But before you go, let me stress, don't get in over your head. Well, we will try to join you as soon as we inspect Lake Verity. Dylan, you'll be okay, won't you? Don, I know you're worried about me. And we've the time we've had is very short. But I, I must confess, I'm starting to fall for you inside of Lily. <laughs> Cause Lily left me for Kanto! I'm still upset about that. Anyways, guys, maybe that'll change in Ultra Sun Ultra Moon. That is it for today's episode. In the next episode, we're going to figure out what's happening at the lakes and all that shenanigans. Sorry I could not catch Fla um, Flareon. And also, sorry that I lost the x if I nicknamed it after you. I truly apologize. I really did want to use you. You were a really cool Pokemon dishwasher. As always, everybody, though, make sure to check out my links in the description below. They're all at United Gamer 101, like Twitter, Snapchat, Instagram. Links are in the description. As always, everybody, this is not just a channel. It is a family, and I cannot wait to see you all in the next episode. I'm out.